welcome back to Bling It Up. Today we're going to show you how to create a sparkling night sky painting. We're going to start by adding four paints to our palette. Blue, purple, black, and white. Now let's start painting. Mix together some white and blue and begin in the center of the canvas. We're going to use a tapping technique with our brush to get this loose and abstract look with the paint. Then we will make our way to the outside and use regular blue and then add some darker edges. Let's do purple on the bottom and work black into the top. Keep tapping the paint around to mix it all together and get some nice gradients. I'm going to go in with some blue and purple to help make the gradients blend a bit more. Then we want to add a little brightness with some white in the center area. If your paints still don't blend well, take your time going back and forth between colors until you have a blend that you like. You will get to a point where there's a lot of paint on your canvas, so a good tip is to use a hair dryer to dry the canvas. Then, if you still want to add some more color, it won't be as messy. I'm going to add just a little more blue and then let it dry again. Once you are happy with your dark blended background and it's fully dry, I like to go in and add some white to brighten up a few spots since this is a pretty dark background. Once the background is done, we need to work on the foreground. You want your canvas 100% dry before you do this. Then we're going to get a small brush and black paint and we're going to start with some lines for the trunks of your trees. Notice the direction that the lines are going in. Next, using a flat small brush, use black paint and tap in some branches for your trees. Notice they are the widest at the bottom and they get much thinner at the top. One tip for this is to try not to be symmetrical with your branches. Random is best. When I'm all done with my trees, I will turn my small brush over and use the back of my brush to tap tiny white dots all over the sky. Finally, we will give our paint one last dry and now it's time for some sparkles. I'm going to use tiny clear gems and bling them all around the sky. These will look like shining stars in our painting. Then, just for a little extra sparkle, I'm going to add some dark purple gems all around the foreground. Look how incredible that night sky looks, all sparkly and magical. Thanks for watching and see you guys next time on Bling It Up. What will you bling?